Good morning. So I haven't really actually started this vlog, but I am filming my first ever vacation vlog. I thought this would be fun to always have to look back on and fun for family to watch, all that good stuff. But anyways, Jose and I are currently in Tampa, Florida. And if you have watched any of like my personal update videos, anything like that, we are considering and looking at a place in Tampa to live in potentially depending on where Jose gets a job but we're getting a feel out for here we're gonna be going to Miami in about a month and get a feel for Miami there as well because we do think the likelihood of Jose getting a job is much higher in Miami but I really like Tampa from what I've seen and researched online so we're gonna figure that out we are currently staying in the Hotel Haya in Ybor City I don't think Ybor is where we would like to live per se, but uh, it's a really cute town. It reminds me a lot of New Orleans, <laughs> but uh, the hotel that we're at is super duper nice. It's smaller, so it doesn't feel too crowded. I mean, we'll see how it feels this weekend, but this is where we are staying at, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like out here. We have a nice male strip club across the street. <laughs> and here down i don't know if you can see is ah we got this palm tree in the way but it is so pretty it literally looks like new orleans and here is our nice balcony it's pretty big but there's a lot of noise on the street so i'm coming back in anyways we arrived yesterday and i didn't really film it at all i just I don't know, traveling can get stressful. It was actually a pretty stress-free travel though, which we are lucky about. TSA was completely empty, like the airport was empty when we got there, so we had to wait for like two hours. There was like about an hour delay because uh, it was storming in Maryland, but other than that, everything was really smooth, really quick. We went out to an Italian restaurant last night for dinner. Oh my god, they literally had the best bread and butter I've ever had in my life. I had we had like a sausage and pepper dish and then we had some gnocchi. It was it was so good. So it's about 9 a.m. Jose and I are gonna work out because we need to after that dinner last night. And after that, it looks like there's a crepe place that looks really yummy from walking distance from our hotel. We're planning on getting some time poolside today. Jose is really excited about the pool. And then we are going to go into the downtown Tampa area. We're really eager to see what that is like because I'm sure Ybor is a completely different vibe. So we want to explore the different parts of Tampa. So we'll probably spend a couple of days in downtown Tampa, but we'll see. We don't even really know what to expect. So that's why we're here. Ooh, these lights are not doing me a favor. Good morning. So I've been doing a terrible job of documenting my vacation, but I'm not gonna feel bad about it because obviously I'm on vacation, but I completely forgot to bring my camera with me yesterday. But vacation is still young. I still wanna show you what I'm doing and whatnot. So I just woke up, it's like almost nine, Jose is still sleeping and i'm just doing my morning skincare routine my skincare is a bit different on this vacation because i couldn't pack my normal skincare stuff because it was just too big so for example i'm trying out the fourth ray am to the pm gel cleanser looks like this it's really cute and tiny my moisturizer of light of the last two days has been the glow recipe banana souffle moisturizing cream I like it a lot, but I don't think I'd purchase the full size, but I did bring my full size Kate Somerville Daily Reflector Mineral Sunscreen because this is what I'm wearing and I didn't want to bring a travel size. Yeah, that's kind of my morning skincare routine. I'm going to brush my teeth real quick. Hold on. No workout this morning like yesterday. I think there's a really nice kind of bakery in our hotel, so we're gonna go there, we're gonna eat there, and I am going to edit poolside. I'm so excited. I know you're probably like, Morgan, you're on vacation. What are you doing? Why are you working? You guys, I love my job. 
it doesn't feel like a job and i have had visions of editing poolside with a fancy coffee and maybe a pastry so that's what i'm gonna do today i haven't done really anything for work the last two days which has been really really nice but i have some videos that i really want to edit so that's what i'm gonna do today i am going to edit while on a nice vacation by the pool So this is a workaholic guys, it's a Saturday morning, she's been working, editing since 9 <laughs> on a video, on a Saturday, in her vacation, that's a workaholic right there. <laughs> Latte. I already ate my croissant. Sorry guys, I got a ham and cheese croissant and a nice latte. Hey guys, it's about 2.30. Jose and I spent all morning at the pool. We did some Uber Eats. We got some poke, which was... I'm going to get ready. We want to go into downtown today, so I want to put a little bit of a face on. A few of you guys asked me to show you my vacation makeup, like a quick look. I mean, it's not going to be super quick. I don't know how to do makeup quick, but I'm going to show you using the products that I brought with me, makeup look that I'm going to wear tonight. And if you missed it, I have already posted it. It is one I'm bringing on vacation with me, so I'm gonna use that makeup. See, I do wanna start off by getting some moisture on my skin, so I'm gonna use the Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisture Cream. As per usual, I'm using my Kate, Summer my Kate Somerville sunscreen. Foundation, I'm gonna mix two shades of the It Cosmetics CC Cream. Okay, I just do a light layer, nothing crazy, and I'm gonna use the Dior Forever Skin Correct. Sorry, I know the echo in this bathroom is wild. Literally, there's nothing I can do about it, but I find that when I'm on vacation, my makeup is just so much less precise. It's definitely more slapped on because I'm not super close to a mirror, and the goal is just generally to look better. And if there's areas that I feel like I need extra coverage, like the nose, sometimes I'll put a little bit more on my cheeks as well. I'm going to do some quick brows with my Kosas Brow Pop. Notice how I said quick. I'm doing my darndest not to spend more than three minutes on my eyebrows. And they're not really even, but they look better. So that's what matters. Okay, I'm gonna quickly set with the By Terry Hyaluronic Hydra Powder. I'm not the biggest fan of this, but it's the only powder that I brought to set with, so it's gonna get used. And we have the savior and star of this trip, my Charlotte Tilbury Stone Rose Beauty Palette. I'm gonna use everything in here. I have truly grown to love these. It really is a true one and done kind of palette. So I love these for vacation. They don't take up a lot of space. They're super easy and quick to use. So if I let myself sit there and choose what makeup I want to pack, I will overpack, okay? And then I will spend so much time on my makeup during the vacation, which is a waste of time. So at least with this, it really does remind me, girl, it doesn't matter how you look, you're on vacation. I'm gonna use this bottom cheek color because I used the chop yesterday. This one's a little bit more natural. You can see I'm just using the same brush, the Sony G Classic Face Brush. And then we're gonna use the highlight in here as well. I want my eyes today to match my face. So I'm gonna use the cheek color as my eyeshadow. So you don't need to actually follow what is in this palette. I've gotten all types of different looks with this palette. Yesterday I used the eyes, today I'm using the cheeks on the eyes. I'm gonna use the lighter color 
on the lid. I'm going to use the face highlight in the inner corner. Let me curl my lashes really quickly with my Rush Ruffer Lash Curler. Maybelline Falsies Lash Lift Mascara. And finally lips, I'm using my Wayne Goss Mauve Lip Pencil. Let's use Christian Audet Where's My Limo. And finally, we're going to finish off the look with Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray, perfect for Florida weather. And here's the finished makeup look. I know the lighting's not the best, but it's super natural put together. And I think without me talking on camera, it took me less than 10 minutes to do. See, this is what view I want. It is so beautiful, guys. <laughs> love, love, love the water. It smells so good at the ice cream place. I like what I smell. Had to get ice cream. I forgot to show you guys the tacos we got. I forgot to show the tacos, but we got some good tacos. They were small, but good. <laughs> we got it from Jenny's Ice Creams. So for breakfast, we have beignets. They look delicious with a guava sauce and some whipped butter. Jose's sleepy boy. Look how pretty it is here. I mean, this is our hotel, but it's a pretty restaurant. <laughs> So I got simple. I got two over easy eggs and then some Cuban toast. Jose got the Spanish breakfast, which has croquetas, omelet, manchego cheese. Delicious looking. Looks good. Oh, slow. Sorry, I missed the rotation. Okay, try it. He's trying the omelet or tortilla in Espanol with some pan. Yum, is it good? Oh, the crunch. Okay, good. <laughs> So we are walking to the streetcar right now. Sorry, by the way, my camera got cut off. Um, well, it didn't get cut off, it died. <laughs> but here's my makeup. I went with Viseart Shoe Shoe for a natural orange look, peachy lips, and we didn't get to see all of downtown last night. So we are going to take a look again today because potential forecast of rain. I don't know if it's gonna rain or not, probably not, but we wanna go to the beach tomorrow. We were gonna go today, but we decided against it, so we've had a really relaxed day today. So I'm gonna take you along with us. We made it. We did not know how the streetcar worked, but just so you know, we were successful. Now we're just looking at downtown. It's so pretty, it's quiet. We were here yesterday and it was quiet too. I really like that. So we're gonna go to the gardens. Got some nice pictures here. It's like crazy, nobody's here. I can just see myself taking photos here. If I were to live here, so many photo opportunities for outfit pics, Jose. You'd be so angry at me dragging you out here. But so, I love cities. I love the high rise buildings. Not a boat person, but pretty to look at. Enjoying a nice smoothie break and snack break at Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Bomb. Literally, I was drowning. Hold on. I was drowning in the heat, sweaty. I was complaining. We needed to stop at the closest place with AC. So, now we're here. <laughs> oh, 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 
We just finished a quick 30 minute workout. We're gonna shower and then we're gonna walk on Ybor. We're gonna get some pizza. The pizza smells so good. So I'm so excited. It looks, I bet you it's gonna be good pizza. And then at nine o'clock, it is Love Island. If any of you guys are watching Love Island, so I'm gonna upload my video for tomorrow and watch Love Island. So I'll catch up with you later. <laughs> he said he wanted extra large. I don't know why he do that. <laughs> I don't know why. I just came back from the bathroom. He got, oh, you can see my bra, but <laughs> he ate so much pizza and he is dead literally dead okay it is time for me to t turn on love island is anybody else watching i know uk is on but i don't know how to watch it oh we're very close to my face uk is on but i can only watch the us for whatever reason we're about to put that on and i'm gonna upload tomorrow's video bye good night good morning we are off to clearwater beach today it's not super close it's like 30 to 40 minutes but it would not be a good florida trip if we didn't at least go to the beach one day we are not big beach people we like the pool we don't like getting sandy but it seems like a sin not to go to the beach i have to show you look how cute my swimsuit is there's a matching bottom but i thought it was a bit much so i'm just wearing some black high-waisted bottoms which is so cute and I will link this. It's from Shein. It's very, very affordable. Let me show you the bottom. The bottoms are a bit much for me. I wish that this was like cut shorter, but <laughs> isn't it so cute? Anyways, so I think we're going to get there. We may eat some breakfast um, and then we're going to spend a few hours at the beach and all of that. So I will see you there. We got home just in time from the beach. It is storming, thundering, lightning. So we still have the whole evening ahead of us. I have no clue what we're gonna do, but gross. It's a disgusting day out. So we Uber Eats, Eats? Uber Eated some sushi from this place near our hotel. So let's see. We have our spicy mayos. We always order spicy mayos or we bring it ourselves, but we can't right now. I ordered ponzu sauce, my favorite. So let's see, I haven't seen it yet. Oh, this is the tempura. Oh, don't show me, show the food. <laughs> I have no clue what we got. Ooh, mm, that's looking good. the presentation for to go. How did that not fall with over eight? Right? <laughs> is it close to the bottom? Let's see, I'm excited. Oh, that's, See, that's, this, this one that's is what I was expecting, yeah. <laughs> okay, anyway, that's so. Jose has miso soup, but we're about to go in. Let's go. <laughs> we were given no spoons, so Jose's using one of the soy sauce thingies to drink his miso. Yummy? It works. Okay, let's try the sushi. We're going to try the tempura first. I love vegetable tempura. Mm. 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 I always judge sushi by the raw, so let me try the salmon nigiri. Mm. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Good morning! Sorry, I forgot to end last night. But anyways, we, do you guys see I was picking at my chin? We are going to La Creperia. For breakfast, I cannot remember if I showed you guys it because we went there our very first day in the morning for breakfast. So delete this, Jose, if I've already said it, but we loved it. They had an amazing latte. So we are going back 
So I yeah, am breakfast time. Let me show you my outfit. Jose's making the bed. I bought this top from Hollister the other day. So you can still get it if you want it. It's really cute. And I just have some leggings and some Amazon shoes because we're probably gonna go to the pool after this and the gym. So no need to look super cute. What? My bone is weird. I don't know why it's like that. Okay, meet you there. Okay, scratch that. They're closed. My heart is broken so now we're trying to find another breakfast plan we ended up at blind tiger coffee and i got a latte with almond milk and i normally don't like almond milk i like cashew milk but it's delicious even with the almond milk try yours jose mm, right that's really good we also well jose got a waffle and then we're waiting on the rest of our food well, doesn't this look delightful? I got an avocado toast with a sunny side egg. It's on like Cuban toast. And then we have an egg croissant, which also looks delightful. This place was a bit pricey, but oh my goodness, their stuff looks awesome. Streetcar station. I'm super hungry. Oh, here's a streetcar, but it's not the one that we want. Oh, it's thundering outside. Anyways, I'm super grumpy because I'm really hungry and we had no food in the hotel. So we're gonna go downtown. I'm gonna get a snack and then Jose's forcing me to go bowling with him. So one of my favorite parts. One of my favorite parts about Ybor City where we're staying is literally roosters just like live here and they're like microchipped apparently and they're monitored but <laughs> you can hear them I screaming <laughs> yeah you can hear them screaming to each other I want him to yell again <laughs> more chicken content for you there's two of them hiding behind the trash can. <laughs> I love it. I'm so happy we caught this. So we are at Splitsville. We're on an hour and a half wait to bowl, so we're eating. So we have mac and cheese, and then we have this giant salad. Look at it compared to my hand. It is huge. We almost, almost ordered two meals. Thank goodness we didn't. All right, cut it up for us. Mix it up, babe. That's a mammoth salad. Oh, yes. Oof. <laughs> oh my god, is that five? I think it is. I think it is. So I just finished watching Love Island. Jose and I are packing all of our stuff and our flight's at 6 a.m. tomorrow. So I'm waking up at 3.30. Our Uber is picking us up at 4 a.m. Oh my god. At least there probably won't be a lot of people at security. <laughs> so, yeah. So I'm going to try and go to sleep. I might see you guys in the morning. I don't know if I'll be conscious enough to remember. So we'll find out. <laughs> Bye. Good night, guys. Good morning. We made it. It is currently 4.15 in the morning. But alas. We are here. Uh, we just checked in with our airlines. So we're dumping our water before we go into security. 
I am pretty tired. I didn't really actually fall asleep. I would say I was like 80% asleep the whole time. Uh, just anxious, you know, but yeah. Good morning. He's sleepy too. Are you sleepy? You're not. Impressive. All right, let's go. Got the whole road to ourselves. Are you ready to take flight, Jose? I'm ready for a nap. Yeah, I think we're gonna nap. See you guys later. All right, so as you can see, I'm home. We did arrive safely. I just wanted to close out this vlog. As you can see, this point of this vacation really was just to get a feel for the city. We did a lot of eating and a lot of just hanging out, which was exactly what I needed. It was a wonderful, wonderful, relaxing vacation. It was a week long and it felt a lot shorter than that. So as you know, and like I stated, we were testing out the city just to see if we would like to live there and we did really like it. It was great to vacation, but I'm thinking I really want to go to Miami extra now to compare. I thought I wanted a little bit more of a quiet life, but I'm thinking maybe I want to live in more of a city area like Miami. So we are going to Miami next month. We already have it planned. We booked our tickets. We are good to go. I'm so excited. But thank you for hanging out with me on my vacation. And thank you for all the advice you guys have given us on Florida in general. I've asked in the past and you guys have been so helpful. Uh, but it definitely is different to see it for yourself, you know. And we did really, really like Tampa. But I'm thinking, especially with what Jose wants to do with his job, we're more likely to end up in Miami, but I enjoyed my time a lot. So that's all I have for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you aren't subscribed to my channel already, I would love it if you would consider taking the time to do so. And we'll see you all in the next one. Bye guys, have a good one.